Hi everyone, welcome to Shez's Kitchen. And this is the first episode of Shez's Pantry Challenge. Really excited to have you all here with me today. Uh, the first challenge is gonna be from my own pantry. Um, let's see what I come up with. Okay, let's go check out what's in my pantry that I need to use up today. <laughs> okay, so this is what I found in my pantry today that I want to use up. Um, I had about three cans of black beans. I have bought double of the coconut oil and the cacao powder. And I'm gonna team these up with some of the staples I found in my fridge and cupboard and make some black bean cakes. All right, preheat the oven to 180 degrees fan force. And then you wanna prep the tray. Okay, so the next step is to literally throw all your ingredients into your food processor. This is my mate Patty, my food processor. Um, so let's start with, we've got cacao powder, baking powder, baking soda, and the salt. That goes straight in there. Uh, coconut oil. Maple syrup, sorry, honey and vanilla essence. Um, the black beans, the tin of black beans. And four eggs. Pop the lid on. I like to add a shot of coffee to mine, but it's not necessary, so you don't have to put it in there. That'll take about three to five minutes. So once it's all blended up, pour it into a jug to help you pour it into the um, prepared tin. Uh, it will look super runny, but I promise it will work. Okay, so now we pop them in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, so here are the finished black bean cakes. Um, I made a quick little icing to put on top just in the blender using honey, cacao powder, a little bit of vanilla essence, and the cashew spread, and using just some milk to thin it out. Thanks for tuning in and watching the first episode of Shez's Pantry Challenge. Um, entries are still open, so feel free to send in a challenge for me from your pantry, even just a few items that you wanna use up would be awesome and you will be featured on our show.